Hey, this video is dedicated to all the moms out there. Today I'm going to make the teeny tiny shoes for my little baby out of fabric. So let's get started. I begin with his footprint marked on a piece of paper followed with the measurement that is the length and the breadth of the toes and the sides as shown. So here is the sole, the toe and the side band. Now based on the footprints and measurements, I prepared these outlines leaving quarter inch extra for stitching purpose. Later cut it off. Now let's begin with the pattern that is done on the toe area. So using the main toe stencil, I'm gonna cut two more such pieces. Fold them into half. Oh, before giving the details, have a look at my pattern. It is a formal shirt with tie and blazer. Now using the two stencils for, one for marking the collar and the other for the blazer. white cotton fabric here, fold it into half and mark the toe using the stencil. Use the collar stencil leaving quarter inch extra for folding purpose. Then let's move on to making the tie using 1 inch satin ribbon. Just tie a knot and keep it ready. Blazer now. Fold the suit piece four times. Mark it using the blazer stencils, leaving one inch extra for the collar folding as shown. ready, let's fix them using a hot glue gun.
tie, stitch the collar at the neck semicircle as instructed. Now overleaf the collar and glue it. we need to prepare the sole and side bands. First cut both using white as well as the suit material keeping them together one on top of other. area which is one and a half inch high overleaf it and leave a gap of quarter inch stitch it again Now insert a thin elastic through the tube and fix the edges with the stitches. Just give a stitch of half inch near the neck, leaving the rest to insert the edge of the side bands. white to white and blue to blue to ease your understanding.
just stitch the edges. Fix the top on the white fabric. To cover the side stitches, follow the instructions shown, leaving the heel area unstitched. After overleafing, close the opening with hand stitches. our final touch. Cut the extra quarter inch from the sole stencil and use it to cut the soft foam sheet which will be inserted inside the shoes.